The whistle tones, also known as whisper tones, is a technique that is done by a flute player very, very slowly blowing a very fine stream of air into the strike edge, the far edge of the embouchure hole to produce a sound that is very ghostly, elusive, fragile, fleeting, all of the above. It's a very, very delicate and quiet technique that can come in two different ways. The first way is the way I, I just showed you where I fingered a very, very high pitch on the flute. In that case, the highest C, the fourth octave C on the flute. And I can then sustain the pitch of that note. I could more or less do that. And then uh, that's a sustainable pitch. The second way is by fingering a very low pitch on the flute, like a low D on the flute. And you can get an effect like this. At the end, I actually managed to sustain the pitch, but that's not what I had wanted to show you. What I had wanted to show you was the beginning, where I was having the pitch go up and down almost uh, on its own uh, by changing slightly the blow angle of the air that is hitting the outer edge of the embouchure hole. Uh, so it creates this effect of unstableness and ghostly quality, all the harmonics from the low Ds coming out, uh, not entirely under control of the flute player, I have to say. So, and that's normal, uh, and that's the beauty of it, I suppose. The whistle tones can also work very well on the other flutes of the flute family. So, for example, on the piccolo. works much the same way as on the regular C flute. And then on the alto flute. To notate for whistle tones, you notate the fingering of the pitch with, again, a diamond-shaped note head. Uh, you don't have to actually notate the actual pitch because oftentimes, the, as I said, the actual pitch is pretty much out of control of the flute player. <laughs> 